Yo, welcome back to the channel. And today's another, uh, you know, talking about another mod that I plan on doing to Crown V, like early part of next year. Also, uh, I was thinking about, instead of thinking about what kind of push bar should I put on her, thinking about, you know, um, I'm thinking about like a Santina or a Go Rhino. I'm going with a regular push bar or going with a wrap around or um you know a complete wrap around, you know, with the bumper bars and stuff. You know, I'm thinking about going with either one of them push bars, putting it on the front of the Vic and uh you know, I still haven't made my mind up yet. You know, if I do want to spend like five hundred something dollars on a push bar, I'm gonna probably go with a wrap around or a complete wrap around. Or I might try to do like the cop car did in one of his junkyard videos. Got a wrap around push bar from the junkyard, just repaint, just spray paint and whatnot. You know, uh but lately, I haven't really seen any Crown Vicks with push bars in the yard. Well, I ain't been to the yard. Oh, no, man. I ain't even been to the yard since I did my birth light switch those days before my re and stopped fucking up. But I'm going to check the junkyards first before I go ahead and, you know, see about purchasing, buying a brand new one. Because I know you can get them from the yard for a great price, probably like 60, 70 bucks. Uh, you know what I'm saying about getting that? And, um, you know, so I don't know, like, should I go with a regular push bar? Santina go rhino? Or should I go with a wraparound or complete wraparound? You know? Just put it on the front, to make the car look more good, you know. Uh, that's what I'm thinking about doing, so. Uh, let me know your thoughts on what kind of push bar should I grab? Or, you know, what kind of, yeah, what kind of push bar should I put on the fix? Uh, it was something else, too. It, it was something else. Um... I can't even think right now. I can't even think what it, what else it was. Uh, I've heard talking about the tents. Uh, only really other thing I was planning on doing to the vet, you know, was get some new headlights and uh, going to the sound shop and getting a. You see, I got an alarm on it. It's like one of them quiet alarms, I guess. You know, it just locked the door, so I was thinking about going to get. Uh, um, another thing I was thinking about getting was a alarm system and a remote start. I had the remote start on the Chevy Luna that you guys have seen me post a couple times. Uh, that thing worked great. Like, man, leave your heat on, especially here in Chicago. Man, it be cold. Leave the heat switch on. Like, if you turn it off, remember to turn it on before you get... You mean, you know, before you leave the car for the night, turn the switch on, and then just start it up the next day. And by the time you get, like, five minutes before you get to the car, five minutes before you leave, just turn the switch on. I mean, you know, just turn it, start the car, man, the car warm by the time you get in. Like, man, I love, I love that. that. Like, man, that, that was the best feature to, that that's the best feature to have on the car. You know, uh man, I, I used to start in high school I used to start the car from my room and before we moved to Michigan for a year, uh we stayed on the second floor. Man, I could start the thing up from the kitchen. The car can be in the front. Like depend on how you know if I had parked on the street the night before. Depend on how far I was you know how far the car was, I could start it up from my room or the kitchen, 
Or uh, if it was in the, like if I had to go in here park in the yard because there wasn't no parks on the street, man, I started to call straight from my room because it, it was in the backyard then. Doom. Cow warm. By the time I get down there, I don't know why I did that sound like that. Uh, but yeah, I'm thinking about you know. I know I'm gonna put that on there too. That might be the first thing I do. Put that, you know, put the remote start and alarm on it. That might be the first thing I do. Uh, but like, comment, subscribe. Uh, let me know. Drop comments. What you think about the push bar?